Hello, and welcome to the District of Columbia Office of Administrative Hearings. My name is Mary Oates Walker, and I am the Chief Administrative Law Judge. I would like to tell you a few things about how to prepare your case for hearing. Remember that the judge is going to decide the case based on the evidence that is presented. You want to consider whether you have witnesses to present. You may always testify on your behalf. Do you know of someone else who saw or heard the events that will be covered at your hearing? If so, you may ask that person to testify for you. If you need help in getting the person to come to the hearing, you may file a written request to have OAH issue a witness subpoena. You can also ask for a subpoena requiring the witness to bring documents. When you make this request to the OAH clerk's office, the legal assistant usually will present your subpoena request to the judge assigned to your case. The judge will decide whether to issue the subpoena. In rental housing and unemployment insurance cases, you may be able to receive up to three subpoenas from the clerk's office without asking a judge for them. In addition, you may prepare exhibits. Do you have written documents or photographs or videos or other items that will help you to prove your case? Remember to make at least three copies so that the judge has a copy, your opponent has a copy, and you have a copy. We require parties to send copies of their exhibits and a list of their witnesses to OAH and to the other party at least five days before the hearing. Please do so, because if you don't, the judge may decide not to consider your evidence or your hearing may need to be postponed. It is also a good idea to practice your testimony and that of your witnesses before you come to court. Practice asking questions from your opponent too, so you and your witnesses are prepared for things that might happen in court. When you come to court, it is very important that you wear appropriate clothing. Show that you respect the court and the proceeding and that you want to make a good impression. Do not bring food or drinks to OAH. Before the hearing starts, turn off your cell phone or other electronic device and don't chew gum during the hearing. It is very important to remain calm at the hearing even if something happens that you disagree with. Don't argue with the other party. Don't use sarcasm or mutter remarks. Don't make faces or use body language that shows anger. At OAH, we show you respect and offer you your day in court. Please show the same respect to our staff and the other party. the legal case can be difficult. If you need help, we have resources that you can use. OAH has a resource center that provides information to help you prepare for your hearing or to decide whether to request a hearing. We also have a list of attorneys who provide free services or reduced fee services. You may also ask our legal assistants for information about these services. Our legal assistants cannot give you legal advice, but they can help you get access to legal services. Thank you for visiting the Office of Administrative Hearings. Have a good day.